So account prioritization is about trying to find those accounts that are in an active buying journey, but not an assumed active buying journey. We need several data points to try and validate whether those accounts are actually active. And the way you do that is by looking for information around the web. So that's where the likes of Nexus or Demandbase or Sixth Sense come in. They give you that third party view on how active those accounts are in researching the types of topics that align with your product or service. And then the data point that's more close to your brand is, you know, what's happening in your CRM, who's visiting your website, who's engaging and digesting your content, either in your on your domains or socially. This is what we call first party and second party data. Whereas the the um, intent platforms that you see a lot of in the market at the moment, like demand based and six cents and Nexus, this is what we call third party data. Mm. And the power of um, finding that intent is when you combine all three of those data points together. And not just at an account level, you need to be looking at a contact level as well. So if you can find accounts that are actively researching and are aware of your brand, and you can see evidence that the account as a whole is researching in other places around the web, then those really should be in your list of priority accounts. And filter those down by your tier ones. So who meets your ideal customer profile um, to the highest degree? And which of those are in that active buying journey across all of those data points I just talked about? That's your priority list. 